Manchester United 3-0 Liverpool, Wayne Rooney. Robin Van Persie and offside one Mata strike as Raheem Sterling flops for Reds. 25 seconds, that was the time elapsed between Raheem Sterling's miss at one end and Wayne Rooney's goal at the other. It is often said that the margins between success and failure in sport are tiny, but they are not really, it was a minute passage of play. But it spanned a gulf between these clubs this season, both are works in progress. But Manchester United are a street ahead. Neither have particularly impressive defences but Louis van Gaal has front-loaded United's team in. Trademark Dutch style and it is starting to show. There are few defensive misers in the Premier League, meaning a team with a strong attack will flourish. And while Liverpool are floundering having been shorn of Luis Suarez and Daniel Sturridge, United have an almost endless supply of stellar names, Wayne Rooney. Robin Van Persie and Juan Mata in the starting lineup. Radamel Falcao and Adnan Genu's eye on the bench, Angel Di Maria on the treatment table. Liverpool had more chances, United were two goals clear by halftime, it said it all. There can barely have been a more brutal example of the need to make scoring opportunities count than what happened in the 12th and 13th minute of the first half. Officially the two events that turned the game were a minute apart. In real time just 25 seconds separated the moment when Liverpool should have taken the lead, and the moment when Manchester United did, penalty shootouts aside. It is hard to imagine a miss that has ever been placed in sharper relief. Liverpool had started impressively, attacking the Stratford end. And the game was only two minutes old when a Steven Gerrard corner ended with Martin Skirrell turning the ball towards goal only for United to clear off the line. A rash challenge from Marwain Fellin on Adam Lallana saw him become the first of many names in Martin Atkinson's book, and then came the move that should have seen Liverpool rewarded. Lallana slipped the ball to Sterling, who was left with only David De Gea to beat a year ago. He would have been hotly fancied to score, yet Sterling has endured an indifferent season, despite the haggling over a new contract. And his finish was time and directed straight at the Manchester United goalkeeper, danger over.